Hello, my name is Don Lupo and I'm the Director of Sales and Marketing here at Acromag for their Process Products Division. Today I'd like to give you a quick introduction into Acromag's TT330 series uh, line of signal conditioners. Now you might be already familiar with Acromag's TT230 series line, which is a true two-wire transmitter DIN rail mount signal conditioner with a universal 4 to 20 milliamp output sync or source. The TT330 series line is a true four-wire transmitter that includes a separate power source, an isolated input, and an isolated output. So by definition, it's a four-wire transmitter. This line has a lot of extra features that the TT230 series does not. I'd like to give you a quick overview. If you'll refer to the screen, I've got a few slides to introduce you to the product line. Now the first slide shows you the TT330s in the center of the screen. And as you can see, the way the line is architected, the analog sensor inputs are wired into the module at the bottom of the DIN rail package. The analog outputs are wired out the top of the DIN rail package, and that's also where you would wire your local power. Looking at the rails uh, slightly to the left, you can see that every module also has support for a bus power connector at the base of the rail. So as you buy these modules and snap them onto your rail, there's a little uh, teed connector that will let you uh, build a power bus on the rail and it might be more convenient to just land your power at the rail and bus all the modules in the line. It'll save you from wiring from it to every module. Over to the left we can see a box that shows you all the analog sensor inputs that the line supports. It includes RTD thermocouple and thermistor temperature inputs, uh, voltage and current, slide wire potentiometer, and even a frequency pulse. On the right side that box shows you the universal analog outputs that the TT330s can give you, which includes plus or minus 10 volts. A sub-range of that would be plus or minus 5 volts, even a plus minus 20 milliamps, 0 to 20 milliamps, or 4 to 20 milliamp source if you need it. As shown, this is a four-wire line and it can be powered between a 12 to 32 volt power source. And this is PC configured signal conditioning from your Windows-based PC and your USB port. And the operating systems that it currently supports is Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows 7, and Windows 8. The next slide shows you the whole list of model numbers in the family, starting with the TT333, which is a universal thermocouple. It moves over to the right to the TT334, the slide wire, thermistor module, and so on. The most popular model in the line, maybe for your control system, will be the TT336, which is a universal DC voltage or current in and out module. This module can be used to isolate voltage and current loops coming into your system, or if you're writing out of your system with a 4 to 20 milliamp signal, maybe to a variable speed drive, you can take the TT336, turn it around, and have an isolated 4 to 20 milliamp output, like an uh, analog output isolator, uh, and isolate as you're driving valves and variable speed drives and things like that. Now the next slide will help walk us through the key features and benefits in the family. First, the packaging. Uh, the TT330s are a 17 and a half millimeter wide DIN rail package with front facing pluggable screw terminals. Front facing makes it easier to troubleshoot the line, pluggable makes it easier to install and swap out modules if you need to. Uh, on the back, as I said earlier, there's a, uh, a power bus connector that comes with every module, it just snaps on the rail and it can allow you to build a power bus with every module you snap on the rail. And also there's a metal clip that helps you clip onto the DIN rail. On the PC side, we've already discussed that this, is a, this will work with your Windows based PC running Windows XP, Vista 7 and even Windows 8. These, these products are very high performance, high accuracy, high stability. They operate from minus 40 to 80 degrees C. They have class one, division two, hazardous locations approvals. They're designed to be used in the process market, the automation market, and also uh, as part of your R&D in the lab, running test and measurement on, on um, things you might be testing. They're powered from 12 to 32 volts DC, and they, the starting price is $220. Okay, I'd like to bring you back and just quickly show you a module I have mounted on a rail. Here's a TT336 module. It's mounted on the rail. As you can see at the base, there's that power bus connector. And as you buy modules and snap them on, um, you can buy one kit that plugs into the, into the end of it. 
which allows you to land your power wiring right here and it'll bust the power along the rail. Okay. The units are USB configured right from your USB port on the front with your PC. Well, that's about it. I hope uh, you found this line exciting. And if you'd like more information, uh, please check out Acromag's website at www.acromag.com. Thanks.